Hi, my name is Neil Fedora, and I'm here with Spiring Federal Systems and Spiring Communications. And we have our latest uh, technologies um, that we're showing here uh, at ION, here at GNSS in lovely Nashville, Tennessee. And I want to show you two demos at the moment. Uh, one is the SIM remote demo that we have shown here. Um, we have Mark Hunter demonstrating uh, X-Plane, which is a commercial off-the-shelf software um, where it's providing six degrees of freedom information to our software, SimGen, shown here. Um, so we have our software, Aspirant software, SimGen. And as Mark turns and banks, you see the attitude of the aircraft being reflected in the information um, being displayed here. So we're receiving that information, generating GPS signals that are being output here on the 8000 um, that are then would be coming to your device under test. This is L1, L2, L5 uh, GPS signals that are being shown and simulated at the moment. And uh, these signals are not limited to that. We also support M code, classified Y code, in addition to all the other modernized signals, L1C, L2C, um, as well. And uh, um, so this is um, showing you the hardware and loop capabilities, which are important for automated testing, as well as um, pilot in the loop, and um, for post-processing and automated um, testing that we would support. In addition to our software, uh, you have all your vehicle dynamics, um, shown here. You see the real-time feedback of the aircraft as Mark's flying an F-4 Phantom at the moment. As he's turning and banking, you see the effects being fed real-time to the, our software, SimGen. As showing here, as the aircraft turns and rolls, you see the attitude feedback being shown. In addition, you have the GPS signals being shown for L1, L2, and L5. The simulator here is the GP GNSS GSS 8000 simulator and it supports L1, L2, and 5. It can also support Galileo and GLONASS. You also have the sky plot of the satellites overhead, in addition to your ground track of the antenna motion being shown. In addition, you have the ability to incorporate antenna effects, lever arms, antenna patterns, um, gain and phase patterns. Uh, we support multiple antennas, and we'll do a demonstration next um, demonstrating uh, uh, that capability as well um, in an unclassified uh, environment. So in addition to the remote testing demo that we just showed you, we also have a controlled reception pattern antenna demo, which we also call SERPA. Um, and we have got different solutions for SERPA testing. Some of them support the military, and some of them commercial applications at L1. Uh, for the military, we got L1, L2, M-code, SERPA solutions. What we have here is an, just an unclassified uh, civilian SERPA demonstration at L1 only, using our GSS 6700s. We got four elements shown here because there's one simulator for each antenna element. We have four elements, four simulators, and they're designed to simulate the effects of those GPS signals received at each element with slight lever arm offsets for each element. So their uh, antenna electronics allows them to then detect and beam steer and null the interference signals. And that's what we have here is a demonstration of, of those. And so you have our software that you saw previously, our SimGen software running. Um, instead of one antenna element, we have four elements here. Each has its own antenna phase patterns, gain patterns that are supported, in addition to lever arms. So you've got roughly nine centimeters in between each of these elements, and those lever arm effects are captured here and then we would simulate those respective antenna locations. In addition, interference and jamming can be combined to allow them to do the beam steering and knowing uh, for those. And this is a great demonstration that we have shown here at ION um, for our customers. But not limited to this, they're also limited to military and much broader range dual frequency surplus solutions as well. And thank you for your time. For more information, come check out our website at spirantfederal.com and be happy to hear from you. Thank you.